breaking news, the lottery clears its first major hurdle in the Alabama legislature. The Senate passed the paper only lottery bill in a narrow vote, 21 to 12. News 5 State Capitol Bureau reporter Rashad Hudson tells us what's next for the bill. After much debate, the paper only lottery option passes in the Senate. I chose in the committee to, to bring out the simplest of the bills with full um, acknowledgement that on the floor anything can happen. Members of the Alabama Senate got their first crack at the lottery bill. None of us want to go back to the horse and buggy era, and that's what this bill does. Before the vote, lawmakers debated and offered changes to the bill, and there was even this friendly exchange. He just gave me a sneaker. Because he, 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 he never seen this Bobby Singleton before. A lot of concern surrounding the lottery debate has been where does the Porch Creek Indian stand on a lottery? We've always been clear it's just having the opportunity for the citizens of the state of Alabama to actually vote on a clean traditional lottery that other states have uh, you know, surrounding us. The bill before lawmakers is a paper lottery only, which does not include any videotype gaming. The instant uh, scratch-offs and, and those type things would all be paper-generated. Republican Senator Greg Albritton remains that his bill will bring in $170 million annually for the state.